What's up, everybody? My name is Michael Stambaum with King Stampede Clothing. I'm here with Label Networks, and um, we're at Magic 2007, debuting our holiday collection and our Spring 08 collection. The brand King Stampede was um, contrived actually from our original online store, which is a which was a um, online record store. Um, it was very de design driven, and um, out of that we started doing our own T-shirts. And out of just doing a couple T-shirts, we developed the brand. After we developed the brand, we saw that our record sales online were going down as people were buying less vinyl. And uh, we're like, hey, let's pick up some T-shirt brands, see what we can do with that. And that's how Boundless NY was born. BoundlessNY.com um, was basically from an online record store and then moved into um, clothing and multimedia and sneakers and everything. Yeah, man, I think um, the street culture in Europe is um, they're really starting to accept us and look to us for influence. And um, I mean, that's definitely a good thing. And um, as our presence grows over there, it just helps us keep our momentum in the United States and domestically. Um, the European trade shows, it's a whole different world. Like you had mentioned, it's more of a meet and greet and chatting and um, developing relationships. And that seems like how they like to do business. They want to develop a personal relationship with you before they actually give you their money, as opposed to the Americans who are just all about their business. I mean, I would definitely agree with the oversaturation, but um, we really try to focus on what we're doing. And not to say that we're not paying attention to anyone else, but. Um, you know, we try to just stay in our lane and concentrate what we need to do to move forward. And, um, I mean, given that we own a store and we have an online store and a physical retail store, we're always looking for fresh, new, innovative designers and brands. So, I mean, I accept, I accept um, new brands up and coming. Like, they have to take our place and we have to take other people's place. Inspiration of the current line, I would definitely say is... Um, keeping it clean and mature. And um, we're trying to introduce a lot of new vocabulary into our line, such as the cult logo and also military specs. And um, just so we, people can recognize our brand without having to use our logo. This is all spring 08. We have a lot of um, you know, nice lightweight casual wear. We have a ripstock button up here with a nice pendant on it. Um, we have a beautiful, Fine seersucker shirt. It's perfect for late spring, early summer. And as I mentioned before, the new vocabulary we're bringing into our collection with the branding, the Colt tag, the mill specs, maybe your classic plaid shirts, which are very nice, the tight corduroy agave embroidery, classic chino shorts, chinos. We're very proud of our denim this year. Look how heavy they are. <laughs> Um, I just think it's almost, it's just necessary these days um, to have a complete line. If you want to compete with the other brands or just be relevant in today's market, you need to do denim along with everything else in cut and sew. Yeah, we've done them with our counterparts, Mishka. We've done collaborations with Mighty Healthy. Um, we've done stuff with the hundreds. So um, we try to keep it in the family and um, keep it moving.